Okay. I'm wrangling calves today. Um, these guys are weaned. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Contact. And they need to go next door to their group pen. So I'm gonna put my phone down so I can try to get her out. Not to brag, but I was having the best morning so far. I got here early. It's beautiful weather. It's like 60 degrees today. Um, I came right down to the calf barn, which um, we already had our other feeder doing stuff, but I was like, I'm gonna help her. Why not give everyone the good cheer today? And then I gotta go up and do my actual job soon. The hoof trimmer's here today. And, uh, just a lot going on and today the weather's making me feel really motivated so let's get to it. go do that my actual job up with the cows but who needs a gym when you have a barn full of cows they like to make a mess so if you guys want a good workout just get some cows here's Roger he's doing really good today you can see he's a lot more lively um, than he was on Friday love you buddy and then <laughs> this is Rice Crispy she has her dehorning paste on you can see that little spot on her head. Yeah. And I was just explaining on Instagram about this dehorning paste. I've gotten on my face by accident, on my hand. And it's really not painful. It's just like a slight irritation. You can feel a little bit of burning on your hand. But I could keep it on my hand all day. And that's why it's good that I tested it out so I know the calves are not in pain when we use it on them. It's a lot easier of a method than burning them off with lidocaine. Like numbing them with lidocaine and then burning them off. So we really like the paste instead of burning. So now I'm trying to solve a mystery because ever since my aunt broke her leg, she's normally the one that puts the new babies into the computer. And I haven't been doing it because I've totally forgot that she's the one that did that. So I'm trying to figure out what babies were born from Saturday until now and who had them. So wish me luck. This computer is how I'm going to figure it out, I think. A lot of question marks here. Alright, so I'm setting some dates up because I am moving a bunch of heifers out of the fresh group. Time for them to have a new home. They haven't paid their rent. They're useless. Okay, here's my list. All the ones circled, all the ones not paying their rent. I've just been here way too long. And they're going to a different group. A bigger group out in the big barn. Come on, girl. You know you're going actually to an even better home. This is one of my favorite cows. She's so cute. Come on, sweetheart. She had a hurt foot, so we moved her over and now she's doing way way better oh that scared me oh that scared me i thought they opened the gate <laughs> oh my god they did open the gate oh my god oh my god they opened the gate the cows are out i repeat the cows are freaking out okay guys stay calm stay calm i don't think anybody went outside just shut the door. <laughs> hey guys, wanna go back in your in your cage right here? You don't wanna go outside. It's not that fun out there. <laughs> oh my god.
screwed. Stop <laughs> Don't go outside. You really don't want to. It's not that great out there. Just turn around. Turn around, please. Please turn around. No. No. Okay, I gotta go for help. I gotta go for help. Come on, girl. Get back in. Please. Please make my life easier. How do I put this stupid door down? Now all the cows are getting out. <gasps> Shoot. Freaking out here. Come on. Jesus. What a day already. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> of course, this would happen to me. Yeah. I know they're having fun. I'm just trying to move you in your house. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, girls. Let's go. Jesus. Sorry, I shouldn't be saying that so much. <laughs> I'm just. I hate when this happens. Like, I don't want to, like, call someone and then have, like, all the cows be fine. I want to try to figure it out by myself. It looks like I did. If I can just get this other. Oh, shoot. Taco? No. That's why I named them, so I can yell at them. Go. Ooh, you're not gonna mess with me with a jersey. See, I haven't let the cows out in a really long time. So that was kind of fun. Thank you for behaving, you guys. Of course, my favorite one's behaving. Come on, girls. Keep moving. I gotta go nuts in there. Hey, hey, hey. Come on. Get in. No. Get in. Get in. Get in. Well, that was. <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Everything is going wrong. I just forgot one. It really scared me. Okay. So dramatic. <laughs> Just forgot one. That's no big deal. Ooh, I can't wait to rewatch. Calm down. I can't wait to rewatch that video of me literally running after those cows and failing. Come on. Come on, girl. Not letting that happen again. Come on. Back in. So basically what happened was someone did not chain this because there's no hook. So the cows pushed it open, leading to them getting out. Leading to them me putting my phone down. I'm like, oh, let's get some footage of this. It's gonna be easy. And you guys saw the cows almost up in my phone. I was like, well, there goes $1,200. Thankfully, it didn't happen. And then I was uh, going to pick up my phone. thought I had everything under control. And they started running, sprinting towards the other end. <laughs> and the rest is history. So I got them in. Everything's great now. So hopefully the rest of my day isn't like that. New clip on the gate, and we are back in business. Not letting that happen again today. Okay, I don't know if it's really warm out today, but currently you can see that it's snowing. 
But I'm gonna do a little more relaxing job now for that little case and clean out tubs. I just scrub, scrub, scrub all of their backwashes. So there it is, a whole lot cleaner. I gotta open up these gates so they can get to it. But there's also another one in the middle and another one all the way at the end. This is my favorite time of the day. Made after the cows got milked, the barns are scraped and clean. Everybody's just sitting around, chewing their cud, eating up there, sleeping, and just hanging out with each other. See, we were missing some free stalls right here, so they can just kind of lay however they want. This is how they're supposed to be. That way we can get a good amount of cows organized in the barns to use have the most efficient use of our freestyle barn. But the second tub, hi, look at how pregnant you are. Oh my Lord, you're a pregnant mama. This is our second tub down here. Needs to be cleaned pretty badly. That's just a bunch of cow backwash. I'm out in the storm. Um, but Jojo texted me saying we give the calves numbing pills before giving them dehorning paste. So I thought I'd just add that in there because I didn't even know that. Because I don't take care of the calves normally, obviously. But, um, that's a cool fact. So, when I get paste on myself and I'm dealing with the irritation, they don't even feel that. So, kind of cool. New calf. He's a big, big boy. Actually, sorry, you're a girl. But it's an Angus. Isn't she so cute? I'm gonna trust you guys on this one. Sad note, my head is popping. Uh, I don't know if I said this before, we just got neon hats, and I'm obsessed, and I'll just link them up here. But you have said that I could. Show needles. And me giving vaccinations to shop, vaccinations to cows. So, warning, it's coming into the screen right now. This is what I'm using. Um, it's Immucel, uh, it's a vaccination we give. And basically I just walk through the barn and find the cow and But I'm gonna show you guys now and if I get this video taken down, because you guys, can you say I could? All right, so I got this list, and I already see my first culprit, this cow right here. So I'm gonna try to get it to her on video. Whoop! Done. Good job, girl. Always gotta encourage them out there. It's like getting a shot at the doctors. So I just gotta run around and catch all of them. Not all of them. Only a valid list. Cows are getting bread tomorrow, so it's another day of me doing the breeding program shots. And this is just so he can spot the cows easier in the morning when he goes to breed them. So the ones that are getting the January shot today are getting bread tomorrow. Just like that. Then I lead them back out. This is the barn. These guys are waiting to get milk. See how it's dirty right now? And this is what it looks like after he scrapes it over here. Nice and clean. Same with this pen over here just got scraped. You can see it's nice and clean. That's how it should look. Cows are clean. Cows are happy. It's been like a lot of fun bringing you guys along in my days. Because normally I'm either talking on TikTok or Instagram. But YouTube is fun too. Um, so that's going to be my video for today, I think, because the rest of my day is just giving shots. And I'm, we're on the second milking shift, and I'm so ready to go home. But I gotta finish up these cow shots, and I have a lot more to show you guys around here. So I'm really excited you're enjoying the videos, and I hope you guys all have a great day.